Hey guys, welcome back. I'm Gene. Today, we're doing a very interesting special workout. One of the muscles that we never really get to do uh, on its own. We use it slightly when we do abs, we use it slightly when we do uh, arms, and that muscle is our neck. Neck has a couple of uh, muscles in the back and on the sides. It is very sensitive and what I want to caution and warn you is be very, very careful and slow. Everything we're gonna do is gonna be very slow and you gotta be very, very careful. Okay, what are we gonna use to work out our neck today? First of all, we're gonna stretch. Stretching is extremely important. So we're gonna do side to side, front to back, and notice that my head goes all the way down in the front and not far towards the back because our spine here does not bend backwards. So you, there is absolutely no need and it's dangerous if you bend your head too far back. So forward, back, twisting side to side, and rotation. Again, notice my rotation much more in the front than in the back. In the back is very, very low. Okay, so after our stretch, we're gonna use a resistance band. This is gonna be very, very interesting. So we're gonna use it the other way. So put your feet into the handles. And what I would suggest is use a lighter resistance band because you don't need a lot of pressure here. What you're gonna do is Carefully place this on the back of your head. So you see, I am, my neck is slightly bent forward and my arms are holding the, the resistance band just in case. And the first exercise is from this position up. The movement, and just gotta get it to the right portion. The movement is, and it slides off. I'll hold it here. The movement is very slight. So I'm holding it just so it doesn't slide off my head. The movement is very, very slight. Keep going up and down. Then what you can do, and again, make sure you're holding it. You twist your head to the side and up. Left side. And then right side. Now, and you can see the resistance band slides off. What you could do is if you have uh, a rubber pad or any kind of pad, put it on top of your head and make sure the resistance band stays in place. It is relatively thin, so any movement, uh, your hair is relatively slippery, it uh, slides off. So, uh, here's what else you could do. So these, these couple with the resistance band, we can put it to the side. Next one is if you hand, put your head, hand over your head to the side, and now just move your head with the weight of your hand on top. So you notice I'm touching my ear, one side, the same thing on this side. I'm just letting my hand rest. That adds a little bit of weight. How many repetitions? Try to do about 20 per side, uh, up and down about the same thing. Three, four repetitions, very, very slow. Uh, start very light. If you don't need to, uh, if you don't feel like using the rubber band or any kind of weight like I showed you with your arm, you could just do uh, stretch type exercises, a slow motion. It will still strengthen your neck, neck muscles. Going a little bit more advanced, what you could do, and these are kind of the, the wrestling and jujitsu uh, neck strengthening exercises is, is on the mat. We're gonna take a wide stance, get into this position. Again, hands in the front. Your head goes on the mat and you go forward and backward. And you see, I'm using my feet to roll my head back and forth. 
the same thing, side to side. And my hands are always controlling the motion. And then you can do in reverse. If you get into the reverse bridge, you do the same thing. My hands are securing my head movement and my feet are controlling it side to side. These are more advanced uh, exercises on the mat and I recommend that you do them very carefully. You, uh, strengthening your neck is always good. It is essential to overall fitness. Take it slow, be very careful. If you have any questions, please reach out to me before trying anything more advanced. When you're on the floor, by no means do not add any weight to your neck, to your back, to your stomach. It is absolutely not necessary. Thanks for watching. Share the video with your friends. Let me know what you think in the comments. Have a great day and I'll see you soon.